There's sort of two big questions, and I'm especially interested in how these two questions kind of relate to each other and inform each other. I'm Alex May. I'm faculty at Perimeter Institute. I work doing research at the interface of quantum information theory and quantum gravity. So quantum gravity and quantum information theory can seem totally disconnected. And they seem that way if you think about them from the perspective of what kind of questions are they trying to answer. I'm from Langley, BC, just outside of Vancouver. Um, so I'm one of a, a handful of Canadian faculty members at Perimeter. We had a forest close to the house and it was kind of a more rural area and we just spent all of our childhood running around in the forest and unsupervised and uh, yeah, building forts and getting in trouble and things like that. Yeah. So the picture here is like, I've taken the, the boundary of this cylinder and I've sliced it open and I've rolled it out on the page and, and that's this thing here. I think I, I think I love the challenge, the way in which you can become totally absorbed in it. When I'm working on a research problem and I'm, I'm really in the throes of it, like I'm thinking about it all of the time. It's just really satisfying to be connected to your work in that fullness of, of a way. It can also be very beautiful. There's things I've learned about physics or, or discoveries I've made that just are, you know, I find really striking and, and feel a sort of mystical or cosmic sort of sense of connection with the world when you are fully wrapped up in this problem and, and you've understood something. And um, yeah, there's a sort of feeling of connection there, I think. I didn't sort of realize that there was this physics community and the way it exists at Perimeter. Um, you know, just walking in the building, you realize like, oh, this is a place that's like built for me or people like me. Um, you know, there's little strips of paper on the bistro tables for you to talk about math with, and there's blackboards all over the place. And um, yeah, the whole space is just kind of acknowledging what you're like <laughs> or something. Uh, and, and yeah, so that felt great. Uh, well, since I've moved to Waterloo, I, I, I bought a house and uh, I've been renovating my basement. Um, so I built a, a basement suite and, you know, installed a kitchen and learned to do my own plumbing and uh, drywall and frame and all these kind of things. Um, now I have a couple of perimeter students living there and uh, I have to find a new hobby. So we'll see. <laughs>